IRS is back in business. They are caught up with all the backlog of tax returns and paper notices and paper letters that people have sent in. In February 2022, the IRS stopped sending out automated collection notices because they were so far behind in processing returns and letters and such. However, earlier this month, which this month is May 2023, the IRS announced that it will now resume sending out those automated collection notices. Taxpayers will start receiving these notices end of May or any day now for some of you and the beginning of June. Of course, taxpayers should not ignore these letters because if you do, it can go on to be a bigger problem. There are a few ways that you can handle the notices that you're going to be getting from the IRS. One, you can deal with the IRS yourself and get the problem resolved, whether that is first time abatement, setting up streamlined installment agreement, offer and compromise, any of that. If the whole process of dealing with the IRS just scares you to death and you don't want anything to do with it, hire a reputable tax resolution company like myself to help you with the problem. Be sure that the company is reputable. A reputable company is going to be asking you a lot of questions and they will want to review your transcripts first to figure out what is the best solution for your problem. If they just listen to you and you say, I've got a tax problem, they say, okay, well, give me $5,000 and we're going to get that situation taken care of for you. That's a huge red flag. Don't go with that company. Be on the lookout. Letters are coming if you owe the IRS money. Give us a call and we can help you out and we can help you come up with solutions for your IRS problems. Have a great day.